guys, welcome to another week of foodie gardening. I am down at the plot watering the tomatoes at the moment. It's really windy, but it's ever so humid. It feels like it needs a good thunder. Um, I have got blight on my outdoor tomatoes, which I know Aaron from Aaron's Allotment kept warning me about. I've been keeping a close eye on them though. So the first thing that happened was that they collapsed as you can kind of see here. And then I started to spot it on the leaves. You can just see the edges are a little bit darker, but what I've done is stripped most of the leaves off now and it does seem to have really slowed it down so I'm hoping that I can get these tomatoes um, ripened before it properly takes a hold. If it looks like they're going to go brown instead of red then I will strip the whole lot off and I'm ready to do a green chutney with it. In the greenhouse is looking quite good. The only tomatoes I haven't had any yet are off these Roma ones they just seem to be a bit slower than the others. The other ones again I've stripped the leaves off more to kind of hurry these ones along really and I've been taking home a few tomatoes every day so it's nice that they're not all ready straight away. Sweet corn outside is coming along too but it's just not quite ready yet. It has been quite rainy this week but back up at home I've been working on digging out the buddleia roots and those roots are really deep. They've taken a lot of digging out. I've been surprised at the size of the roots. You can see why people have trouble with foundations and paths and things being lifted by the roots. They've really spread out across most of that plot. So hopefully if the weather stays nice, I'll get more of that done this week. And that's it for my little update. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye-bye.